This is one of the experimental aircraft that we built for testing. At the moment, the tests are in the final stage, and we now have these aircraft for control tests. Uh, that is, these control tests are checking the readiness of the aircraft for operation and its maintenance at airfields. To do this, we must make a certain number of flights and practically show our information bodies that the service on board the aircraft and at the airport meets the requirements that are imposed on aircraft of this class. Well, these advantages were laid down at the stage. Sketch project without... Initial. The inherent advantages simply did not make sense to design an aircraft. It was laid that this aircraft should have from 10 to 12 percent. Better economic efficiency on routes in the area of medium routes is from 4. This is 5,000 kilometer TA. The design that we have here is the main one, this composite wing and... Engine for good economical... Yes, uh, composite wing is not a tribute to fashion, but a forced measure which can make the wing of large elongation, and the wing of large elongation has good economic quality and low resistance. At the same time, it turns out in the sum. These two main factors allow you to make an aircraft. Economically, well, due to the fact that we have better economic quality, we allowed ourselves to make a wider fuselage. This is not a wide fuselage, of course, an aircraft, but this is the largest fuselage diameter in the narrow fuselage class. This allows the passage to be wider. This is a convenience for passengers. These shelves are deeper. It's also passenger comfort, but it's not just passenger comfort. It's also operating hours optimization. Disembarkation and maintenance of the aircraft, that is, wide aisles, allow the passenger to exit the aircraft faster, and therefore to prepare him for the next departure faster. Today we fly to Irkutsk. On board is the management of the Irkutsk Corporation, the management of the design bureau, and employees. As part of the load repeatability test, we flew to Krasnodar, Perm, Mineralnyvody, Nizhny Novgorod, Murmansk. In different cities, different programs were carried out. In particular, general inputs flew to recruit and evaluate the system. In Murmansk, the work of initial systems was evaluated. On high. A very large geography of flights is planned for latitudes next year. Tomorrow, the solution of how you give the test passes successfully. Currently completing the special constructor list. Previously, this is the final phrase before getting a specific type. Uh, I would like to note that the plane has a very light cabin, very light. It has large portholes, like on wide-body aircraft. It is also very comfortable to sit, that is much more comfortable than in similar aircraft because there is a very wide seat up to the knees, that is, there is no need. Sit and nothing interferes with sitting, even if someone spreads the back, it will still be comfortable to sit. with modern lighting and the latest equipment, allowing flight attendants to comfortably prepare their service. Similar unified kitchen racks to accommodate equipment standard atlas. Very comfortable under nose tables to place food. There are also aluminum carts. Very convenient in maintenance and operation. Food is available for economy class passengers. Containers or ovens, beverage equipment, electric ovens, the same standard are placed at the rack of the airline's choice. Food is heated for passengers.
coffee boiler machines are combined on the basis of the flow rate of the heater into one system. This saves weight and space for maintenance.